Sometimes you need a helping hand to pick you up and get you back on your feet. In Arkansas, Restore Hope has been that for those in the justice and foster care systems. Since 2016, the group's goal is to reduce the incarceration rate and the need for foster care. Tonight, they celebrated their achievements. Neil Zarang is in studio to share how one family lost everything, but Neil, they were able to get it all back thanks to the nonprofit. That's right, Laura. The Myers story touches every point of why the governor and faith-based organizations came together and formed Restore Hope. Tonight, they stood beside giants in the agency's first award ceremony. Walking into the governor's mansion, Patrick and Amanda Myers are at heights they never thought they'd achieve. This mountaintop experience is one they climb to from a pit of despair. Sometimes it's kind of overwhelming to look back and think about that time. Three years ago, Amanda and Patrick were addicted to drugs, had issues with work and housing, and eventually their children were taken by the state. They were crushed and didn't get out of bed for a week. You feel like you don't belong back, like you belong in a corner somewhere. And uh, embarrassed to come out. We finally started, we got to do something. The caseworker connected the Myers to 100 families, a Restore Hope initiative to move families from crisis to career. We started sequencing those things properly, and they did the work. It was just a clear path laid out before them. Three months into the program, they got their children back. In time came a home, a car, and for Amanda, a career as a case manager within Restore Hope. We have so much more to fight for. You know, we got that chance to kind of redeem ourselves um, that we didn't really think that we would have. Their story is one of many celebrated Wednesday night as Restore Hope had its first award ceremony. It's not the only thing the Myers are celebrating as they have another baby on the way. They're excited about the new world they're bringing them into. The passion you need, they help you find that. Just like to help my wife find it, you know, without passion, it, you'll fall back pretty quick. Still continues to be difficult, but it's worth it to have that something to be proud of. Restore Hope presented Governor Asa Hutchinson with the inaugural Hope Award for his, contribute, for his contributions to Restore Hope and its missions. If you'd like to learn more about how it has helped the Myers and other families, find the story on our website, karak.com. Back to you, Bob and Laura.